Greetings and welcome back to Monster Legends. Okay, so this is the day after my little run through the maze. We had the 30% discount yesterday, ran through the maze. I was successful in my endeavor. And of course, I posted that video yesterday. If you want to see it, it's available on my channel. Uh, in terms of other things, well, let's first look at uh, what I consider to be the rather critical one. And that is, of course, the uh, Worm Lad Challenge. As you can see, I'm going to be able to get him. It's just a matter of how cheap I'm going to get him, as long as I do it before I go to bed. And just to be sure, I scotch taped a big piece of paper to my pillow. It would be pretty hard for me to go to bed and uh, not see it. Know what I mean? So I will get him. It's just a matter of how much of a discount I'm going to get him for. So I'm going to continue to work on these. Hopefully we'll get some multiplayer wins. That would be very good. You know, my, maybe my viewers will help me with that. And um, that'll be great. I will probably start trying to hatch him immediately. Uh, then I am going to have to uh, hatch a certain um, dragon then, too. I already have the epic in there. That's Armwald in there, I believe. Because, back to the book. This, is, of course, is a temporary little book. And this is the page that I am interested in right here. Uh, I'm working on the epic right now. After... Um, after what's in uh, Worm Lad is done, I'm going to put Drag R in. And down at the bottom, you can see there's 60 cells of, uh, uh, of um, Worm Lad down there. So when I get those, I'll throw in some light cells, of which I have, I believe I have 159 now. So I will definitely be able to rank him up. And then speaking of ranking up, that dragon. In the meantime... I have been continuing to collect uh, coins, and oh, look at this, we have a discount, don't we? It's only a 10% discount, but it is a discount. So where's my little friend now? Here he is. All right, I already have 21 cells of him from grabbing cells already, but I see there's some more cells here. And it does seem to be inexpensive at the moment, so let's go. Why not? After all, it's a discount. Okay, a lot of food, not interested. However, I am interested in 13 cells. Okay, so I'm running 34 now. That's not so bad. Okay, and there looks like a spin coming up here. And some more cells. That would be a very good thing. All right. Um, by the way, I would like to thank you. I'm pretty sure that the cells you gave me did the job. Not my first choice, but I'm not going to complain about it. He did give me enough of the, uh, the coins that made the difference. All right. Wow, it looks like there's two in a row here. All right, let's see how much we can get. Okay, another 16. That looks pretty good. And I can keep going. Another 19. Ooh, I'm not going to test my math skills on that one. Okay, food. Is that it? Am I done? Nope, nope. I got one more move. That's 22. That's not too bad at all. And I still got more than two and a half days. I'm just lucky that a discount showed up at just that time. All right, and I got two more sets here. The last one was 22, so that's not too bad at all. Um, I'm thinking he's looking like an easy rank up, if I, especially if I have to uh, adjust it just a little bit. Let me just see here for a second here. And into the light. 91! Oh, if I get those next two, that's a lock. All right, so definitely a rank one uh, rank up, and uh, I won't have to spend a single light, uh, light gem on him. Light cell, I should say. So, yeah, that's good timing, good timing. So, um, I, I think even if I don't run into another discount, I'll probably be able to save up enough to actually uh, get more cells of him. So, that is a good thing. Very good thing indeed. All right, and um, what else do we have? Uh, I think we still have that breeding thing. Do we still have that breeding thing going? I just... I, I tried, like, once, and then that was it. Where was it? It's still going right here? Yeah, this one here. So it's got two days left. Um, I don't know. Um, I don't want to clog up my hatchery right now, but I think that once the worm lad thing is done, I won't be so crazy about having to have a couple of slots available for the hatching and breeding updates. So I might try again. You know, I might try again. We'll see what happens. Uh, my luck for those has been very bad for quite some time. So I just don't want to clog everything up. Because after all, I am going to have a uh, legendary in there probably tomorrow morning. I might just do it tonight, though. If I'm going to hit the button on him tonight, I might as well start uh, hatching him tonight, right? All right. And, uh, uh, well, I mean, the thing is, the Wormlight thing is going to be done 
tomorrow, early tomorrow morning, and that's going to be Saturday. And then the um, the maze is going to go on to, I believe, Monday morning. I think that's the timing on that. So I guess we're going to get a whole bunch of stuff next week, right? And uh, of course, Sunday is going to be the special 750 PvP. Now, I've recorded four of the sets. I'm going to record the last one early tomorrow morning. Uh, at that point, I'm going to make the, uh, the, the video asking for teams private, just like I did the previous one. So it's going to vanish at that point. And uh, then I'm going to start putting the video together. So, you know, the thing about it is it takes a long time. And if there's any problem, I have to watch it and make sure there's no problem. I'll have to rebuild it again. Historically, the files are big enough and they have so many pieces to them that it takes about a, like an hour and 20 minutes, hour and a half, an hour to build the, uh, the file. So if there's a mistake, I have to rebuild it again from scratch. But that will be out on Sunday. Sunday. So I might like, what I try to do is I try to almost make it a little day off for me. You know, that way I don't have to worry about anything. And considering it's a Sunday, I think that'll work out pretty well because I'm going to have a hectic Monday. Anyway, I think that's about everything else we got going. Like I said, we're going to probably have new stuff next week, and we can probably talk about that next Tuesday. All right, so why don't we uh, go to war here? We won the last war. I don't think we're going to win this war, but maybe I'm just being pessimistic. They're really kind of strong, right? All right, it's, uh, they, have a, they have a lead on us here. Um, they've attacked more, but, you know, they have some strong stuff. You can just look right below there. You can see uh, that's a really fast Kihaku right there. That's the one that I did. Um, a lot of support speed there. That would be a big problem. And of course, there's a Mephisto there. So yeah, there's a couple of Mephistos around. That's a lot of support speed there. You know, I'm going the wrong. If, you know, at this point, if I see a 15, there's probably a very good reason why I see a 15. You know, that's the thing. If no one's even tried it, I like got no, 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 no. Um, can't do anything about that one. Yeah, absolutely not. Nope. Yeah, I'm going the wrong way here. All right, I'm going to skip the 15s because if it's a 15, chances are, like I said, no one even wants to even try it. Wow, that's a whole lot of 10s, isn't it? But that's a team, you know, if Avira was allowed into this, that would be a team with a lot of problems to it. But um, yeah, that's not a prob team with a lot of problems. Well, that's interesting. I mean, dangerous, they're high level, but I'm wondering whether or not that speed is going to translate. Let's just take a quick look here. Uh, that was my team. Okay, 50s, 50s, 65. Okay, that, 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 that concerned me for a moment. And there's a whole bunch of ugly relics on them, isn't there? This is, by the way, this is not my number one team. Um, I'm fast to you. You're, you're, you're fast, but the question is, can we actually do some good killing here now, right? That cryotin does not have enough to do the big group freeze. But, I mean, these guys have got some really good stuff here. Um, this one here, wait a minute, wait a minute. Strength, I think that's what I have on my guy, right? All right, what do you have? Armor, right. Speed, okay. All right, you know what? Let's just try it and see how it works out. Um, oh, actually, it's not going to work out. You know why it's not going to work out? Is because I can take the stamina away from one of them, but I can't do it for two of them. Which means that um, I can only stop the Agursus or the Cryotin. The other one is going to act. It also depends on what um, Dave does for us, too. Should I do this one? I don't know. Uh, let me just look around. Maybe we'll come back to this one. It's just that I can't deal with both of them, you know? And I'm not going to even look at something that's got their own uh, Ragnarok. Oh, that's just ugly. Wow, there's only one left there. And I can see why. I mean, it really depends on... Um, Hold it a minute, hold it a minute, hold it a minute. Let me just think about that for a second. I'm, I am like thinking that I have to use him. What if I went a different way? How fast are you? You're the fastest one here. You're 6,500. What if I was to not use him? 
and I was to use Kihaku. I don't know if I would be able to get him up that fast. I do have some support speed around. 68. Okay, so that might take care of the two mountains. And it's also going to depend on what Dave does for us. All right, let's just, just, just try and see what happens. Okay, what did you give us? Cooldown protection. Okay, that's a... We really need a freeze on the frog. That's what we need. I need possession on them, and I need a freeze on the frog. We're dead. Oh, right, anticipation. Oh, I, I completely forgot about that. Um... Shock on you. No extra turning. And death to you. No more frog. I forgot, he had anticipation. Okay, he turned red, so he was really mad. Alright, um... Ouch. Okay, let's think about this. Um, yeah, Cursus is going to hit us like a truck, and the other guy is going to do some freezing here. I can't kill the Cursus. I might be able to kill a Crouchin with... He's got two torture effects. I'm going to put Curse on him. So that might do the job. Oh, what did you do? Oh, you put a shield on yourself. Okay. All right, you're dead up there. Don't have to worry about you. Um, heavy damage, and I think disabling his trait is a really good idea. Can I prepossess them? That sounds like a better idea. Okay, you up there, you don't mind. It doesn't matter. You're already dead. Um, e. Let's just see if we can do a little bit more damage to him. And then we'll do a death door. Okay, he's got two torture effects on him. And he's dead. And he's dead. Okay. Well, I got out of there with two. Right? Okay. So that done better than I thought it was going to end up. All right. Let's look around here. Um, that one is absurdly fast. So I'm going to be going with Tara. So we'll have to see how that works out. That looks way too fast. How does that actually translate? Just out of curiosity here. Yeah, I probably could... What do you have? Oh, you got the Energizer Staff. But it's not leveled up. You're only giving 15 points. Uh, he's immune to possession. All right, let me, let me throw my... The thing is, this cane is a killer here. All right, let's just... Um, Let's just put my team in. Like I said, I'm going with uh, Tara over here. And uh, I believe I was going with a frog over here. Now, who did I use the first time? It probably was Kane. I might have actually gone with uh, O'Reilly here. But I think Kane might be a better idea. All right, let's throw him in and take a look at the situation. All right, and she's rocking a 73. Okay, so she's going to go first. He's got a relic to give a stamina back, but it's not a great one. What do you got? Maximum life. All right, that could be a problem. I need the frog to kill the other cane because um, he can't get him to bleed, right? All right, I uh, don't know, but let's see. All right, and give me your stamina, please. Yeah, 15 points isn't going to do the job. Okay, um, I need you to kill him. I really need you to kill him. Very, very much kill him. You may now change targets. Yeah, I mean, if that if that had been leveled up to the point where he could have done an attack, it doesn't make any it doesn't make any sense to put a level one version of that on there 
because it's only 15 points and you're not going to be able to do anything with 15 stamina, you know? All right, well, this is working out very well. Um, actually, he's going to be able to kill the last whole team himself, isn't he? That's what a properly configured Prince Charmless can do. Okay, that worked out a lot better than I thought it was going to. Uh, but they have a really tough team, so um, I don't know. You know, we could come back. We could, but uh, we'll have to see. Uh, I had to obviously pick my teams very carefully because, yeah, the 15s, you can probably bet, are not overly uh, accessible. That a well, that one's got a Mephisto on it. That's the problem with that. I was wondering why hasn't that one been attacked. It's because it's got a Mephisto on it. That's why. Anyway, uh, that's how the war is going for us now. Hopefully we can uh, stay in the winning column, but uh, we'll see about that. Anyway, let's do some PvP. Because we do have to do PvP in these videos as well, don't we? All right, and of course, they're down there. Okay, so let's get going. All right, our first team today was suggested by Thunderbolt1183. And Thunderbolt1183 wanted to see uh, Sparta right there. And next up, we're going over to Magic. And this is going to be way down here. Jelly. Oh, Jello, I should say. And uh, on the top here, playing Denial today, will be Tara. All right, so we got some damage. We got some Denial. So let's see what we got. We got a Keithor up the middle, and I don't want to mess with a Keithor. Um, do I... Can I take a Corel Brutalis? A 110 would probably... Have, nah, I don't think so. I don't think I want to mess with that. Um... The right doesn't seem to have denial, except of course for the um, the metal head if he uses the stuns. Right, why don't we just do that? Okay, I'm okay. I'm seeing that a lot these days. I don't really know what's up with that. Anyway, give me your stamina. Now, let the slaughter begin. All right, let's think about this. Who is it? Uh, I'd really like to get rid of the metalhead because of his ability to possess and his uh, stunning. He's very stunning. All right, I think I'm going to go for the boosting here. Okay, you guys can have some torture effects. I don't suppose you want to chill down here, do you? Yeah, you do. Okay, Everest mode. Okay, that means I'm going for you. Okay, did you miss here? Ugh. Stabby, stabby. All right. Um, very heavy damage. In I think this is a better idea than the other ones because I want torture effects going. Okay, good, we got bleeding. Okay, and we got bleeding too. Yes, we have bleeding. Okay, you have regeneration on. Um, okay, and you have to charge. And we're taking your stamina. And I'm stealing some of your soul. And you're dead. All right, let's think. Um, why don't we just make sure we don't miss? Right, Sparta? All right, and boom, you're dead. Okay, and that worked out really well, and I got a little sword for that one. I needed three swords, but I'm sure we'll win four today. Okay, I'll take the rune. I guess he's going away. We're probably going to get the other guy back. Hmm. Oh, well. All right, so let's go in and put up team number two. Team number two was suggested by Northwest Weathernet. And Northwest Weathernet wanted to see, starting over in Thunder, and this is going to be 
Zyla, maybe she actually gets to hit somebody today. She's had to run a bad luck. I think she's going to. I really do. Uh, because the next individual is going to be Nova. And making his first appearance in a, um, a PvP fight is going to be... Where is he? He's here somewhere. He's hiding. He's shy. There he is. Tanky. All right, so let's go. All right, so obviously um, Nova is very good at denial. So we can pretty much take on whatever we want. I um, mean, we could do this one on the, um, the right because if there's anybody who can kill a uh, Kuro Brutalis, it's Zyla, right? So why don't we actually do that? Okay, yeah, why p damage on a Nishan's pet? Sure, why not? Okay, and you guys didn't need your cooldowns activated? Yes, you did, actually. Okay, and let's just make sure there's no missing going on. Of course, we know Xyla never misses, but, you know, just a little bit of guard down there. Okay, this shouldn't take very long because there's only one um, health and then there's a support speed on the Corel Brutalis. So, this is not going to take very long. As a matter of fact, it's a three-hit job, isn't it? And I don't know, it's to be a four-hit job. Because after all, there's the light one there a second time, right? And why don't we just finish that? And then she'll just move on to the next one, right? Oh, one shot, you're dead. And a little extra stamina there, and... And Tanky doesn't get to do anything. He just gets to stand there looking imposing. Okay, another sword. That was quick. Ah, okay. I would like to have had some Skulker just saying if the option was open there, you know? You know, rank up bugs. Okay, so let's go in and check out our third team. Our third team today was suggested by Brian Soldad. Hope I said that right, by the way. And Brian wanted to see, first we're going over to Fire. And someone who doesn't get picked very often. Not that I'm encouraging it. This is going to be Flamey. All right, next up we're going over to Darkness. And he should be close to the top. There he is right there. We got uh, Fido going. Actually, I don't think we've seen him for a while. And over in Thunder, um, we got Xyla's Mini-Me, which is Zap. All right, so let's see what we're doing here. We're going to do in Possession, which means the Undertaker is just out of the equation. Um, yeah, War Masters. Let's not do War Masters. It's just nothing goes right with that idea. 115, 115. Uh, I mean, it's really not any denial up the mill. That's the thing about it is. I mean, she can disable traits, which can be dangerous if someone follows up on it. It's just that I don't think in this situation there's any trait disabling that's going to be a problem. I suppose we can just do that one. They do have a 115 out there. Is she supposed to be denial? I mean, she's the one with that speed. Okay, I just don't understand the team. All right, well, we do have a couple here who are uh, hardened, so... He's just too magnetic. Okay, so let's see. Uh, let's do some killing. Um, I think I'll get rid of her first. At least she'll be the first target, right? Oh, is she taking stamina away? Uh, little dribs and drabs, actually. Is that level one? Yeah, I look, I think it is. I think that's a level one. It's only 20. I mean, if you're going to put something like that on, you know, at least work on it a little bit, you know? I mean, something like that can be very powerful. And you're dead. All right, let's see. Um, I'm thinking you down below, because mostly because you're easy to kill, because you don't have as much health as him. Okay, don't miss. 
Okay, and uh, that's gonna be it for the stamina. Okay, that was nice of you. Let's see. Um, should I try to stun him or should I just try... I'm gonna have him do the, um, the double damage. All right, let me think. Obviously, you're immune. Yeah, you're immune to uh, possession. All right. All right, uh, you're already blind. Okay, actually, I can get rid of the one down below. All right, so we have one target now, and he's blind at the moment. All right, let's just pick away at him a little bit. Okay, can we finish him off? Okay, so I did the double damage on Firestorm for no reason. Okay. All right, and that worked out. I think that's all the swords that I needed, too, for him. Okay, um, I'm going to let that slide. You did help me with the maze coins, so I'm going to let that slide. All right, so let's go with our fourth and final team for today. Our fourth and final team was suggested by Madela MN, who gave me three teams, and I went with the third team. And Medela wanted to see you over in light. We're going to grab Nana very carefully, though. Uh, next up, we're going with a lady with a slightly different attitude. And she's in metal. And this is going to be Nebula. And finally, in, this is an odd addition, but could be very, very useful, depending on our opponent. And this is going to be McCree. All right, so if we get like an extra turner, that's going to be very useful. All right, let's look around here now. We're going to be doing, uh, we're immune to possession. So that's something to maybe target for, right? Although I don't want the freezing thing thrown in. So I'm just going to reach over and hit the button, and we're just going to check out the next team here. All right, not doing the middle, obviously, because it's all epics. And I don't want to mess with the Temerian. One more time. We'll take one of these, obviously. Uh, not the team on the left. Nope, absolutely not. Not doing that. Yeah, I probably would have been better off taking something earlier. Um, I'm thinking up the middle. Uh, one reason there's an extra turner there that McCree might actually like playing with. Um, of course, we do have that problem with the freezing and the... Yeah, that could be a problem. So we'll have to see. Oh, 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 that's right. That's right. Be right back. All right, over here. I, I forgot to grab them beforehand. I actually have two of them. Uh, I was saving one in case there was a mishap, right? All right, let's go back in. And we're going to do the team up the middle and see how that works out. All right, obviously she's going first. So let's go. All right, uh, freezing is only could only work on two of them, so we'll see how that works. Okay, it got both of them. All right, all right, she's going into weakness to all and evasion mode. Okay, so she's evading at the moment. I'm wondering whether or not I should um, have him ready for a big hit. All right, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have him buff. Okay. Um, oh, and I forgot to do those two, didn't I? Hold on a minute. Um, double damage. Is she getting double? No, no, she's got the weakness down. All right. Okay, so I just gave her double damage now. So they're weak to metal, and uh, she's gonna use metal, and now she has double damage. Okay, and in the meantime, I think she should bake your eyes. Okay, she got everything down there, too. Okay, you shielded. All right, and don't stop it. Remove negative status effects. I don't think we have it. All right, I'm j Oh, immune to control. Yeah, 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 definitely. If he does a, a freeze on us, we want to be free from that, right? Oh, so you did absolutely nothing there. Did you just try to freeze us and uh, possess us? Yeah, because that didn't work out too well. By the way, that's really going to hurt. 
Yeah, I, I think you're, you might already be dead, but let's just add to it now since uh, he... Um, actually, you're just kind of dead, aren't you? Okay, that was an execution squad there. And it worked very effectively. All right, so we're going to spin. I'll take the rune. Okay, and I think that we're done. All right, so obviously this is episode number uh, 749. So the next episode, of course, will be 750. 750, of course, that'll be on Sunday. That'll be the big PvP episode. We're not going to have anything else thrown in there, PvP. We're not going to be talking about news and events until Tuesday. Now, if you want a, um, if you want a, a team in Tuesday's episode, which is going to be 751, put them in the contents of this episode, right? You put them under here, and chances are I'm probably going to be a, a combination of that and 750. It's usually the way it works out. But uh, if you do here, I'll see them. You can put them in 750 as well, and they'll be in the action. If you still want to squeeze in uh, a chance for a team in 750, you still have time. I'm not going to go looking for my final three teams until tomorrow morning. So, you know, that's the thing. You still got chance here. You got about 15 hours or something like that. So if you want a chance to slip something in, um, it's very possible. Anyway, I think that's going to be it. So the next thing up is 750, the PvP episode. That will be on Sunday. And, of course, this is Friday. And um, I think that's it. So anyway, thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See you.